What's up gamers? Welcome to the Gamer Center. My name is Dan and today I'm going to show you how to install SweetFX 1.4.7. It's a fairly straightforward installation and uh, I shouldn't lose anyone along the way. So first thing you want to do here is download SweetFX version version 1.4.7 and you can find it at the website in the description here uh, embseries.embdev.com blah 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 whatever. So yeah you click on SweetFX 1.2 here click download and boom download yeah so what you want to do is just open it and just go into sweet effects 1.4.7 uh, rar here okay just uh, copy all this into the root directory of your game and well the, the directory with the exe file in it so for uh, for dishonored you would have to go to program files bethesda softworks dishonored binaries win32 this is the one that has the exe right here so what you want to do is just copy this over i'm not going to copy it because i already have my settings uh and this is next part here this is the next part how to uh, change the settings so you need to go to sweet effects underscore settings and this is where you change all the settings now i have copied uh i believe this top section here so just copy it uh, and paste it. It was in my last video, or not my not my last video, my uh, my last sweet effects video right here. And uh, just copy it from the description, and just stick it in there. I have two different sections, so you can't just directly copy it. Uh, you have to uh, you have to actually copy this this section, put it under the uh, choose effects section, and then copy this under HDR settings section. So yeah, uh, I, I changed a couple settings here. It's nothing too major though, just more like color correction based stuff. And uh, to do kind of like split screen to show off the graphics or to show off the like improvement or whatever, this is where you do it. You do split screen mode three. This is on uh, vertical 50-50 split. And you have to go all the way up to the top here and put in one for use split screen. So whoops, not 21. <laughs> Okay, so exit it, save, and uh, you should be good to go. I'll be back in Dishonored showing you what it did. Okay, so I'm back here in Dishonored, and uh, this is what it did. You just did like a vertical, or yeah, vertical 50-50 split, diagonal, sorry. Uh, yeah, so you can see it's just like the comparison here, left and right. This is this side, the uh, right side is obviously the improved one. The left side looks all washed out and gross. That's why when I first started up this game, I was like, screw that. It just, yeah, I had to, um, had to get some new something for it because it just looked awful. But yeah, no, um, turn split screen off and then boom, there you go. You got a nicely, uh, nice looking game. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video and were able to uh, benefit from this tutorial. Um, yeah, so like, favorite, subscribe. See you guys later. Peace.